Hi, I just wanted to say a few things about the um, awful stabbings that we heard about yesterday in Reading, where I believe um, there were three deaths, and uh, my thoughts are with um, the families at this time. Um, what disgusts me of all, most of all, really, is the way the mainstream media have handled this, you know. They seem to be very slow in getting any information out, surprise, surprise. As we just uh, found out now that it was an asylum seeker who um, carried out these terrible acts. Um, I mean, this guy could well have come over on one of those dinghies that we keep seeing day in, day in out coming over from France. So, you know, these are the sort of people that are coming across and they're coming here and, and they could harm us like we've seen. You know, we've got to start taking this more seriously. These people could be absolutely anyone. We can't just allow anyone into our country um, because acts like this could, could happen. I mean, the government is their duty to protect us and they are failing big time at this. Now, the other thing um, that really did concern me, uh, we heard earlier in that day, there's a BLM protest um, at that park. And I mean, there's a few questions here, but the first one is, um, a law was passed last week that so that um, gatherings of more than six people weren't allowed. So why weren't the police um, um, sorting this out? They should have broken this crowd up a long, long, long time ago. They shouldn't have been protesting in the first place. So it just shows that they've got an absolute lack of balls here. Um, if it was what they say, the far right, then we know that the batons have been drawn. They'll be all down there dispersing people. But it seems like, once again, that BLM seems to have a, a special pass, so they're allowed to do these sorts of things. Now, BM, BLM said that this was nothing to do with them, these stabbings. But, I mean, it's a bit of a coincidence, isn't it? I mean, it may not be directly um, related to it, but it's certainly indirectly. And the irony is, they were all calling um, um, for refugees uh, just um, prior to this, singing, say it loud, say it clear, refugees are welcome here. I mean, the irony, do they want people like that coming into our country? Uh, begs the question, doesn't it? Bloody pathetic.